be okay and this motherfucker is going to be okay and this motherfucker. Like, comment, subscribe, share, dislike, do all that, do something, but show some love, right? So, look. Now, what I believe to be Dolo the pilot man, right? Um, I'm just gonna get my thoughts. In this video, I'm not really gonna break down the gematria behind his name, cause I didn't really even get into that. You know what I'm saying? I'm just uh, the reason why I'm even bringing this person up in the first place, or I even bring other people up, is because multiple people will be asking me, what do I even think about these people? So today, I'm just gonna tell y'all like a brief overview of what about what I feel about Dolo the pilot name. Now, before I even start talking about that, I'm going to say this. Um, Foster eBay, when he, quote unquote, exposed Dolo the pilot man, you know what I'm saying? It was more of a, you know, it boosted his career a little bit more, so to speak. Let me just say that. Now, before I, now, let's talk about the information. Now, the information that this person brings is very on point. You know what I'm saying? I'm not I'm not even gonna jack like the information is very on point. Now when you talk about houses and astrology, I'm not really there yet because I haven't done any research on it. I'm more so um into the conscious aspect of life and what surrounds us here on earth, not um the astros as of yet. Now do I think he's a little bit feminine and zesty? Yeah, because in one of his songs, he was talking about how he was sapiosexual. But that doesn't take away from the information that dude is bringing. Like I ain't even like I said, the dude be bringing like good information. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's a couple of things that I think is like kind of questionable, but at the same time, it, it is what it is. Now, when you start discussing like. If y'all start to pay attention, you know what I'm saying, like, he do a lot of hand signs, you know what I mean? Like, and y'all got to question what the hand signs mean. Now, in every culture, in, in every, um, in just whatever, every culture, right, hand signs, the same hand sign could mean a different thing, you know what I'm saying? So the Masons can use the pyramid for one thing, but the Egyptians use the pyramid for another, you know what I'm saying? So... You have to understand that and understand that everybody that is in an occult, right, don't necessarily work with the Masons, right? They don't all work hand in hand, right? There are different cultures and cults that just literally work with themselves, right? So, like I said, Dolo, like, the information is there, but it's like, bro, it's a lot of stuff that's still being subconsciously sent to y'all at the same time that y'all taking in, you feel what I'm saying? So just be aware of that. Like I said, you learn a lot from these people, um, you know what I mean? But just be aware of what's taking place on a subconscious level because y'all not, y'all not being aware of that is really a wear and tear on your mind whether you know it or not because you'll start to implement or get, like not implement, but mimic the person's actions, like, I say be okay in this motherfucker's movie. I know a lot of y'all be, like, saying the same shit when I start the video, right? Or spiritual soul, gazer, gazer, you know what I'm saying? So, when people do that, right, they leave an imprint on your mind and on your soul, you feel what I'm saying? So, when you sit there and you watch these people, and you watch their actions, like, uh, like, what they do with their hand movements, their gestures, and all of that stuff, right? You start to take on them same characteristics. So, like I said, be aware. Like I said, you're going to learn. You're going to learn from watching from bro. But just be aware. Like, I'm not, like, I'm, I shouldn't have to tell y'all, like, what's taking place with every single one of these spiritual teachers. You know what I'm saying? Y'all should be able to pick up what they putting down at a certain point because it's like I'm laying out the road, the map for y'all. Like, for instance, right, um... I'm going to just say this, right? I feel like a lot of people feel like this person may be schizophrenic, right? Let's just, let's talk about it, right? A lot of people may feel like he's schizophrenic because dude be, and it's my, like, like literally changing to like 17 different people, like, 
he's giving a live speech. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, it's like really weird. But uh, when you look at schizophrenia in itself, right? You understand that schizophrenia is a spirit or an entity that they have named schizophrenia. You know what I'm saying? So schizophrenia consists of a lot of different energies, you know what I'm saying? People literally see people while they walking around and laughing, like, you know what I'm saying? And like in a lot of his lives, like he would like do certain things that make you think that this person is literally schizophrenic. And so when you start to watch people like that, you take on them same aspects, you feel what I'm saying? That same energy, that same entity, you know what I mean? So if your mind is, isn't strong enough to uh, uh, deflect what is being thrown at you, you see what I'm saying? If you don't understand the psychological aspects that's taking place while they're teaching you, then you're already losing, you know what I'm saying? You're not really learning any new information, you feel me? You're learning, but at the same time, you're turning into a zombie. So what are you really learning? You see what I'm saying? Your soul is being taken while you, it's like, it's like this, right? When you in school and you write down on, and you learning out of them books, you learning how to, you learn how to go through life and use these tools. But at the same time, your soul is being taken. You see how that work? You see how that work? And that's the same thing with a lot of these spiritual teachers. Y'all have to understand. Of course, you're going to learn. It's just like school. It's here for you to learn. But it's also here for you to be controlled on another level, right? I told y'all, if somebody can control y'all with fear, they can control your body because the body reacts before the mind, before you can even think. You see what I'm saying? So when uh, you get into a situation, you start thinking about what would Dolo do? What would Dolo say, right? And Dolo would do it like this. And so you start to do it just like Dolo because it seemed, because y'all, uh, building a bond together your your characteristics have changed because you have been uh giving your time and energy to this person so your energy literally becomes one the two become one you see what i'm saying so you go out and when you get into uh circumstances where you need to speak up for yourself you do it just like dolo or you do it just like dog and now you look at somebody look at you like bro are you schizophrenic or bro are you zesty or bro are you weird or bro you know what i'm saying it's like you take on and then you like oh I'm, I'm not i'm not this way but you not knowing that the whole time you have been taking that in psychologically and um, um spiritually you've been taking and now you thinking to yourself like what do i do to get this what have i been doing like how like how do people perceive me that way it's because you've been giving your energy so like i said is is no more to be said. Um, I can go into gematria about this person, but I don't really, I ain't really finna do that right now. I don't really feel like doing that. You know what I mean? I just wanted to give a brief overview and say it one more time. Yes, this person has really good information, but also watch. You know what I'm saying? Watch. Peace. I'm gonna be up with another video, bro. Like I got another.